Oftentimes, both sides are claiming victory today after a judge's ruling that will affect the future of Houston's Equal Rights Ordinance. Our Jace Larson is in the newsroom now with this developing story. Jace? The ruling today pertains to a, peti a petition that was aimed at repealing the ordinance. Mayor Anise Parker says there were not enough valid signatures to put the measure on the November ballot. Opponents filed a lawsuit, and today a judge decided this case will go to trial in January. This is what we were looking for. We, we want to proceed to a trial on the merits at the earliest time. Opponents of the ordinance are claiming victory. They say there is plenty of proof that there are enough valid signatures on petitions to force a popular vote. We showed up with witnesses, with documents, with ample evidence to prove that we're entitled to a right to vote. What did they do? They cut and run. But City Attorney David Feldman also seemed pleased, saying the mayor intended all along to put the law on hold. This is entirely consistent with what the mayor said when she announced that the petitions weren't valid. We expected them to sue, and we look forward to a trial where we can you know, demonstrate that, in fact, the petition is not valid. This January court date is considered a quick one. Similar cases can take a year to go to trial. That court date means this ordinance would not be up for a vote under any circumstance until at least November of 2015. Live in the newsroom, Jace Larson, KPRC Local 2.